Kyle Beer from the fairway on 18. Currently 200 for his round, 600 for the tournament. That one just spinning a little too much. He has his birdie putt from the fringe. Not quite making it. Should be able to tap that in for par. That'll give him 10th place all on his own. A leading amateur. Carl McClatchy now from under the trees trying to hook that one in to this flag. Fortunately, didn't look enough, left himself a challenging chip down the hill. Almost impossible to stop that one. Needs this for par. Fortunately, not making it. Taps that in for bogey. But still a good tournament. Seventh place, all on his own. Lejean. A leading lady player in the tournament from the rough under the trees. It is well protected green water and bunkers. Taking that nicely around the bunker, getting a favorable bounce. This is looking better by the minute. And what a great shot. She'll have a foot for Birdie. Michael also coming in from the right, trying to use the slope behind the pin. Unfortunately, spinning that a bit too much, that needs to slow down. Luckily, off the fridge, stopped that before it went into the water. Samuel having to come in over the willow trees. It'll be a bit blind for him, the shot. Also, using the slope as a backstop, also needs to settle down. Luckily, off the fringe, stopping that. Chipping now for Birdie. That was so close. Easy sees the funny side to it. Tap that in with his wedge. Fortunately, five over for the day. Level par, 11th place. Also one of the up and coming amateurs. Michael now for birdie. That thing popping off the fringe. Regular contender, Michael. Tap in par for him. Once again, a top 10 finish. We'd end up tied for eight. On now with a tap in birdie. What a way to finish. Minus three for the day. Tied with Michael in eighth place. Top ten finish for the lady. Armand now from position A. Tacking this flag. Straight over the top of it. Fortunately. A little bit too much spin. Oh, lucky to stay dry. Tanda pushed his second a bit right. It's coming out of the trees, needs us to trickle down onto the green. Fortunately, getting stuck there. Herman now for his birdie. Trying to chip it in. Coming up. A couple of inches short. Tap in for Herman. That'll give him fifth place finish at seven under par. Tanda trying to save his bar now. Not easy to stop this one coming down that slope. Slides on a couple of feet by. Good save bogey. Sixth place finish for him at six under par. Jason now with this putt to join the leaders at ten under. Fortunately knocking that one through the break. Still an important putt coming back. That would eventually give him third place all on his own at minus nine. Keelan now with this crucial putt to get to 10 under. What a birdie finish. Ricky will have a putt now for the outright win, but he's currently tied with him. This putt for the win and the tournament. Unfortunately, just running out of steam. That'll be a par. Ricky and Keelan finishing at 10 under, going to a sudden death playoff. Harry now with his bogey putt. 
trying to limit the damage that he's done. Fortunately, Bogey drops him out of the lead. One shot behind the lead as he misses out in the playoff. Um, it wins a lot. Um, I don't know for many people don't, who don't know, but I, I don't really speak about it. But last year, May, I lost my mom to cancer. So this win, is, this win is dedicated to her. And I've also been inspired by my brother's recent form on the amateur golf scene. So yeah, this is all credit to her. And I just want to say thank you to her for everything she's done for me. Um, today was a tough day. We got here, the weather changed completely. It started raining. The first nine holes we played in complete rain. Um, I tried to steady my ship and just make bars. I made nine bars in a row. I ended up starting with a birdie on 10. I felt a lot more at ease, started putting better until I got to 13. I, um, 13, yeah, I had a three putt. And then I obviously told myself, just stay patient because guys are going to make mistakes. The conditions are tough. And then um, through 14, 15, 16, guys started making bogeys. And 17, 18, I, I managed to make a birdie on 18 and I birdied in the playoff as well, so it was a good finish for me. Um, I hope that I'm just going to play on the Big Easy Tour. I have my card there, so I just want to try to get my card for Sunshine Tour and then I'll take it from there. You need a golf ball that goes far. You need a golf ball that goes far and flies straight in any wind. A golf ball that goes far feels great off the tee and puts you in control. With a micro-engineered cover that boosts spin on every low pitch, high lob, or flighted wedge that stops on a dime for a kick in birdie, you need a Z-Star from Srixon. Built for distance, 